all right good morning i am making a quick video um today i'm going to it's 11:04. i have a my first appointment today well i don't know if it's an appointment or whatever but i'm attempting to go to orange theory well i'm not attempting like i'm going i have um i have to be there at 12 30 i think the class starts at one it's my first time i'm a little nervous because i'm not a big workout person i never have been um like my whole life, like I would probably just go away. If I, want, if I went to the gym, it was cause like, I was going with friends and stuff and it was like actually like when I was like younger. So um, today I signed up like, you know, like my boyfriend's been going to the gym every day and I'm just like, oh my gosh, like I need to do something for myself too because like I'm not losing any weight for what, for what I'm doing. So um, I weighed myself this morning. I'm at currently at 222 point something. So I'm gonna round it up, 223. That is the heaviest I have been in my life um i'm 30 years old like i need to start doing something for my health because if i don't do it for myself then nobody else is going to do it for me so i know i i have to do this like it's not like about i want to i'm i'm extremely nervous especially because of the environment like um usually you know that you go to the gym and you kind of just do the workout yourself and here it's kind of like more like, especially what i was looking up it's more like a class based type of environment i think it's a an hour workout but they have you do like different intervals um, so I'm super nervous, um, obviously I'm not very confident in the way I look, so like just getting in there and then, you know, some people that have been going to the class, like the class and have been doing it, um, they're probably more advanced, more experienced. I mean, I'm just going through like my, my feelings right now, like how I, how I feel. So I'm like, I don't even know if I'm dressed right, like I'm just wearing a t-shirt, my little hat, I'm gonna wear some little, ugh, ugh, we're gonna change that, we have to change that. Um, I'm just I have to push myself and I guess I'm gonna just document it I feel like that will hold me accountable to make sure that I'm doing it every single day or staying consistent with it at least um, the cool thing that I personally liked about this um, is that you sign up for the class and you're basically like if you don't go I'm assuming they charge you because I'm getting a free class it's my first one but they did have me put my my card information in there and I'm assuming if I don't show up they're gonna charge me I think it was like $34 so yeah, like I think that even more on its own just holds me accountable to make sure I go and I show up when I'm saying I'm going to show up. So like um, personally, I feel that's going to help push me to get to to there every day or whatever, because I think you set up your class like before. I'm like so nervous right now. I'm, like I think like my stomach's like in knots and stuff because I'm like I've never been somewhere like that or like usually like I'm the type of person like, oh, like I'll go with a friend. So I'm completely doing this by myself. Um, and I'm, I'm super nervous, so I hope the people are nice and stuff. Like, I mean, whatever it is, what it is, I think I'll, I'll still benefit from it, but I'm super, super nervous to be doing this. Um, Like like I said, by myself, I'm usually like, oh, like I'll go with somebody, but I feel that I depend on people to push me, so like I have to push myself. I need to, again, I need to do this for myself. I need to like hold myself accountable, you know, invest in myself. So <sighs> day one, um, I'll touch back and, let y'all know how it went but um I'll, I'll give you full raw experience like from the moment i walked to the door how how did i feel like and i'm telling you right now i'm like feeling super super nervous and this is before i've been going Whew, i'm excited i'm like oh i hope i could keep up like but i'm just gonna start like stop doubting myself because i know like i'll be like oh my god i can't do it and like no 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 like you are gonna do it you're gonna like if other people could do it then you can do it too so i'm gonna We'll see how it goes. I'm like, oh, I'm so nervous, but I know it's gonna be good. Like, I need, I need to lose this weight. Like, absolutely. I'm like, like I said, I'm like the heaviest I've been in my life. I know I don't look as attractive as I should, so I'm gonna put in the work for it. So I'll let you know how it goes. Bye. All right, I just got back from my first, um, I guess, workout with Orange Theory um personally i didn't know what to expect um i was like a little nervous at first and sorry let me just adjust myself um i i was like oh my gosh i'm gonna go in there and people are just gonna be looking at me you know like the usual like fear of i'm pretty sure people that don't usually go to the gym like feel it like for myself um <clears throat> so <clears throat> excuse me so I pulled up, um, there's another car that pulled up next to me and it was actually like one of the girls that works like the front counter there. <clears throat> so I walked inside and then like, she's like, oh, you must be Judith. Like I, they were already like expecting me cause since you signed up for the class, 
you are required to show up 30 minutes before um, the class starts. So for example, mine started at one and I showed up at 1230. Um, I showed up a little earlier just in case because I'm like, oh my gosh, I have no idea what's going on. Um, at the time, the studio was empty. It was just her and some other um, gentleman at the counter. And I was like, oh my God, what am I getting myself into? What am I getting myself into? So yes, <clears throat> I was very nervous. Um, she then gathered some paperwork. We walked over to like the little bench and then she started just asking me questions about myself. She didn't, uh, I like at no point did I feel weird about anything. Um, I was just being honest. Um, like there was no reason to lie. Like I'm there for a reason. Like I'm not going to be like, oh yeah, I go to the gym every day because I don't. And I'm pretty sure she could see that I don't. So I just wanted to make sure and paint this picture that, yo, like I have not worked out in God knows how long. Um, so yeah, they do, they do ask you like, what do you do usually like for workout and stuff? And I was just honest. I was like, look, it's been a while. She's like, when do you think like you were like at your best point? And I was like, probably like 10 years ago. Like, um, if I'm being honest, <clears throat> so probably like in my twenties and then I hit my twenties. And then that's when I started making bad decisions for like, what would I was eating, what I was consuming and stuff. So I told her like, look, I'm 30 now. I just weighed myself <laughs> this morning. Um, I completely want to change that. So um, she just kind of like asked me like what what was like one of my goals. So they will ask you like about your goals. Um, I personally, mine was like at least lose 50 pounds and then from there just go. Um, they kind of ask you like what are you looking to gain from this experience? And I just said consistency. Like I want to make sure that um, I get myself to to keep going, you know, like being consistent and just following like a like a routine, getting into habit of wanting to work out because again i'm not a person that likes to work out i don't like to go to the gym like i just kind of like don't find that like push and motivation to unfortunately it sucks i wish i did like i like i see people and i'm like man like i want to have that because i personally don't so that's why i signed up for this class because i was like well let me see what it's about you know like having somebody like guide you and and tell you what to do because and, and that's something that i explained to her as well um like when you go to the gym you kind of just go and there's a bunch of machines and not really knowing how to use them i don't know if it's just me or somebody else like every some people feel that way you know like and then you're kind of just looking and oh okay so that's how you use it you know and just that embarrassment so I, I you know i went in and i was just gonna leave it all at the table like hey like i don't know what i'm doing like i have been making bad health decisions so um it's time to change she i felt like they were kind of taking it easy on me like they didn't want to like push me but I'm like I want you all to be like no like okay this is the right step da, 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 da. so as far as the push from the girl from the counter I didn't feel like she was pushing which is good like I guess also in a sense you don't want to feel like they're pushing like orange theory down your throat like oh you gotta sign up you gotta sign up so I felt like I was able to make that decision so then uh the coach shows up um she like um introduced me to her you know um she kind of showed me the machine she walked me through they walked me through um the establishment i mean it's a it's a small compact place um really clean i liked it um at the time it was just me so i was a little more nervous on top of being nervous because it was just me there and then they're like oh it looks like you're gonna be the only one for the class and i'm like oh gosh like i'm already like awkward like i don't want all eyes on me and here i am like it's just gonna be me by myself like whew, you could imagine but thankfully like once the class started some other ladies showed up um, so it was actually two of us. So I kind of felt like, okay, that for me, I think be, like thinking that I was going to be myself kind of freaked me out a little bit because I'm like, oh my gosh, like, uh, I don't know if I want to do this by myself, but then somebody showed up and I thought that would be awkward, but it was like actually better. Cause it kind of pushed me to like, want to keep up, you know, like, don't give up, you know, you're not by yourself. Like, you know, seeing that lady like rowing, like, and she, she was somebody that goes naturally. They, like, you know, and the good thing is that, um, they know your name, they lend you like some little band <laughs> that they put on you and then your name comes up on the screen. Um, kind of keeps track of your workout, your heart rate, um, like you call it like the orange zone and the green zone. <laughs> I'm still getting used to it. They explained it all to me, but at the time I'm just like overwhelmed with information. So I, I know like the more I go, um, I'll be able to understand more of like their little metric system. Uh, but like I said, I, I felt very comfortable. Um, I didn't feel at once like, oh my gosh, this is embarrassing <clears throat> because even though like, um, for example, I was doing like the little weights and stuff, they have like a little, um, three, four step, like little different things to do while you're on the floor with weights. And at some points the coach would walk over and correct me. And I felt like it wasn't like, oh my God, I don't know what you're doing, but it was actually like, I felt like they were genuinely trying to teach me the right way and correct my form and stuff. So 
I really liked it. I felt great. Um, I did kind of like stop and catch a breath like when we were on the floor doing the weights because I did kind of feel myself like, whoa, chill out, <laughs> like hold up. But um, other than that, I felt so good. Like treadmill, I hate the treadmill. Like I, I, just looking at it, I'm like, uh. But to be honest, like I felt like that was probably one of the funnest parts for me. <laughs> as weird as that sounds, you know, like I felt like I was actually pushing myself. I felt my, like I'm, I was getting like tired, like, you know, like I was really, really giving it my all. And they tell you like incline and then. You know, she's like, all right, the, um, we're going to take a 30 second to 90 second break. You kind of like walk through, slow your heart, and then you go back at it again, all full speed. So other than that, like, I think it was a great experience. Um, at the end, they'll meet up with you again. They'll, they'll walk you through. Um, they'll show you the board, which again, they lend me like the little band. Um, and then they just show you like your progress and how you how you did, um, what you could work on and which, what they recommend um for me personally she recommended for me to go like at least three times a week but personally i want to push myself i want to commit to this because i knowing me and again this is just me um if i don't commit to to doing it every day like i feel like i'll be like eh, tomorrow I'll go oh then i'll go she only said three days so um no i <laughs> um she walked me over she was showing me the different plants the girl that worked at the counter that approached me at the beginning of this um, and she just kind of told me, she showed me the different plans and then I saw the one that was unlimited classes. So I was like, you know what, if I'm committed, like I'm going to commit to this. It was not the cheapest option, obviously, but for my journey and what I really want to accomplish, like, I feel like, Hey, like if you're, if you're serious about this, then you're going to commit and you should have no doubts about it only because like you're being real about it. Like you want, you want to make sure that you continue coming. Um, every class I believe she said was like $28. So I'm like, mm, if I do, you know, I want my goal is at least five classes per week. So if not, <laughs> go all in and go all seven. I'm going to like push for five. And then if not, if I can, if I feel myself like wanting to, like I'll push for the seven. But I'm like, it's $28, you know, I'll get bang for my buck. Um, overall, I signed up for the unlimited plan. It was 160 that might be a little pricey. They have different options, like eight classes, um, four classes, stuff like that. Again, all up to you. They, they don't. I I didn't at one point feel like they were trying to persuade me to take the unlimited. Like she showed me, she showed me the stuff. Um, if you do do the unlimited, they do give you like this little. Um, they don't give it to you. They like have you sign um, guaranteed. Like if you don't, if she says you have to at least a 10, 12 classes, and if you don't feel that you got your money's worth based on those 12 classes like they'll give you they'll refund you back your money so if you're being serious about it and you <clears throat> mom were like hey like i went through 12 classes and i don't feel that this is doing anything for me and then they'll, they'll go ahead and refund you your money but i really doubt it like i feel like energized right now <laughs> like um again i'm not the person that wants to like go up and go unfortunately but um after that class i really felt excited like um i was like oh my god that was an hour that went by so quick like usually like i dread going to the gym because i'm like oh being there for an hour like so um i really liked it i again i i personally went all in because i really loved um the experience of it um you don't have to but um so then they also there's this heart monitor i just wanted to show you and i'm not trying to promote it in any way but um, i personally bought it because again i want to ensure that i stay committed to this um so this is actually they lent me one of these and they put it right here like on my forearm um this just keeps track of you like on the app and stuff um they have the little um they have like tvs up top and they have your name um your splat points they call them splat points um again i don't know like all the lingo and stuff yet but um i invested in this they said that they could rent them out to you it's like ten dollars per session but if you really want to see like your progress and stuff i i would recommend it again um this was my very first time and i don't know i'm either a sucker for buying this or it's gonna really come in handy which it better because i have invested um quite a bit just to make sure that i keep myself consistent and going i've already signed up for two classes for the um i signed up for one tomorrow and then one for the day after um the coach recommended that i take tomorrow off i was like no days off just kidding but i just I know myself <laughs> again you could take your day off and like recover i don't know how i'm gonna be feeling right now i'm all billy badass saying that i want to <laughs> i'm ready for tomorrow and i'm gonna be like oh gosh i can't even get out of bed but no like i'm gonna continue to push myself 
because I know that this is something that I want to do. Um, I do want to lose weight. I want to be at the weight that I was 10 years ago. So <clears throat> my goal is to lose 50 pounds and I'm going to continue to track this and, and share my 100% experience and be real about it, you know? If I don't see any progress the first week, I'll let you know, like, um, and then continue. Just, um, I doubt it. I mean, I, I have to fix, like, my eating habits and stuff like that. But I don't foresee me not um, gaining anything from this. Um, what else? Um, again, I felt like they, they were, if anything, they were trying to tell me, like, chill, slow down. Because, she, like, again, she told me to take tomorrow off and then go back. Um, on Tuesday, but uh, I want to go ahead and go tomorrow and, and see um, throughout the workout the way that I felt um, <clears throat> My legs were wobbly. I, I felt like whoa like my legs were jello after especially after getting off the treadmill Like I felt like I was floating, you know, so um, But they're like no like that's how you feel and then there was another lady in the class and She's like, oh, this is your first class and it was crazy because at, at the end of the class Like you get to see like where you like measured up with like people and I felt like Hey, like she's been here longer and again like um everybody's different and they explain that so some people you know could do more could do less and stuff but i i felt proud for myself i guess being able to compare um our numbers with somebody that like often goes there and kind of more or less like we were kind of hand in hand so i, I took that as an achievement because i was like oh my god like i really felt like i was gonna do like <laughs> one workout and call it quits so the fact that i was able to do the whole hour and then at the end be like that's it like it really 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 pushed me to want to continue going and you know um pushing myself so again if you're thinking about a weight loss um journey or something um this is just me this is me being me i'm not anything i'm just your typical you know 30 year old girl trying to lose weight <laughs> so um i think I, I do have like those insecurities, you know, oh my gosh, what are they going to say about me? Like, how do I look? And I don't want to go in there and this and that. But I, I felt like you got to just kind of leave that at the door and then just go in. You know, people could say what they want, want to say about you or talk, whatever they want to say. But in the end, like you're supposed like you're going to do this for you and not nobody else. So and that's kind of the mindset that I had to get myself into because right now I'm, I'm saying it. But I had to get myself in that place to tell myself, you know what, like this is what it is. And. You're gonna do it even tomorrow i like i'm i started overthinking and i'm like oh my gosh she told me to because i'm like an overthinker so the coach was like oh take tomorrow off and um come come back on tuesday and even me i'm like oh well she told me and i'm taking a class tomorrow and it's with her i'm like what if she sees me and she's like hey well i thought i told you to take tomorrow off but i'm like well, whatever in the end i paid for it and i want to do it and if um i want to push myself to be there tomorrow then let, so be it you know so again like i'm just gonna stop with overthinking situations and stop overthinking um about what people think of me so in the end um i know it's gonna pay off and we'll um i'll be tracking my progress again like i said every every day or every other day and then um i'll, I'll continue to to let you know how it goes all right other than that that's all for today um i will touch base with you later all right i'm just going to post up some snapshots of my workout today um, this is what it will look like with that band. They'll send you an email or if you have the app, you'll be able to access this through the app. Um, here's mine, for example. The cool part I liked about this is that it keeps track of it. And then you'll also be able to compare your day to day, week, month, which is this um, shot right here. So that's pretty awesome. All right. See y'all later.